So this question says, what is the y-coordinate of the y-intercept of the graph of 3x over 7 equals negative 5y over 9 plus 21 in the xy plane? All right, so I think that I would love to see all of this in slope-intercept form, y equals mx plus b, because then I can just identify the y-intercept by identifying what b is. But I can probably also just realize that the y-intercept is where x is equal to 0, right? So I can just find it directly. So let's just do that way first. I think that probably will get me there a bit faster than converting this into slope-intercept form. So what would happen if x were 0? Well, if x were 0, that means x would be 0 right there. I'd have 3 times 0, which of course is just 0. 0 divided by 7, which is also just 0. So I'd have 0 is equal to negative 5y over 9 plus 21. I'd then subtract 21 from both sides of this equation. And I'd have negative 21 equals negative 5y over 9. I'd then multiply both sides by negative 9 fifths. And that way I'd have just y, because right, this would cancel out. I'd have just y over here on the right-hand side. Now, what would happen on the left-hand side? Well, I'd have, again, like a negative 9 over 5, basically times a negative 21, practically over 1. I'd multiply the numerators together, so negative 9 times negative 21. Let's go to my calculator and see what that is. That's 189, so I have 189, positive 189, divided by 5, right? 5 times 1, just multiplying directly across. That's how you multiply fractions. So I'd have 189 divided by 5. I cannot simplify that. 5 does not go into 189. There's no common factor here or common, um, yeah, there's no common factor here between 189 and 5. So that's it. That is my answer. Y is equal to 189 fifths. 189 divided by 5 is our answer here.